Hey there, this is Lana's Enchanted Sky, your spiritual fairy godmother, bringing you your general reading for March 2024. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading hypnosis, whatever I do. Please also visit EnchantedSky.com. You can book a reading there. And also take a look at any of my merchandise. There's tie-dye on there. I keep forgetting to tell everybody. And I have a book coming out. So please check. Be you watching the podcast uh, station, 216thenet.com. Um, we'll figure something out and you can find anything you want from me. Joke of the day. my joke. <laughs> what does it mean if you find a horseshoe in Ireland? Some horse lost their shoe. <laughs> Happy St. Patrick's Day. So this month, it's, it's all about emotions and it's all about making things better. Now, there's going to be a little bit of juggling. There's going to be justice. There's going to be juggling of money, juggling of papers, something, money's going to be spent or made this month for depending on the person. Now, I do want to tell you that for Scorpio, Scorpio is going to be, there's, okay, there's going to be a little bit, there, something might be coming up, but there might be money. There's good news coming. All right, we're going to say it, that, put it that way. And there's money coming with justice involved. So this could represent, I'm going to show you this reading in a second. This could represent a promotion or a raise. It's emotional. And there is a person of power involved. This could be a boss. This could be a doctor. It's something to do with that. And I know that there's going to be a lot of juggling and a lot of busyness here in March for my Scorpios. Now, this can be, um, it can be juggling of time or money, time or money. And maybe the money is coming just when you need it. And you're going to be cutting yourself loose. You don't... This card is a reminder that what you probably need to be doing is do work. Do I need to cut something out a little bit? Where do I need to, you know, I, I've had the solution there the whole time, but maybe I'm not really looking hard. So, you know, if you're juggling your money, take a good hard look at that. Um, even though there's money coming, what practical stuff could you do maybe to keep from juggling money every month? You know, do I have a little bit more money possibly coming in with some good news? But maybe I need to be thinking about that and being responsible with your money. Now, this is the King of Cups. There's a wise counsel. So this could be you if you are a uh, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. And it could be you being the king the, of the emotions, being the wiseness. It doesn't matter if it's male or female. But, all right. And it's here you setting goals and we're putting up boundaries. So it's you figuring this out because you're tired of being discontent. You're tired of some of the garbage that you, you know, I'm going to make my life as easy as, easy as possible right now. And whatever I have to do is what I have to do. And there's going to be an ending with something new coming. I still want to say it may be financial or fiscal responsibility. And I want to tell you that Scorpio is not always known for that, but they can be. Um, they have this attitude, especially water signs, that, oh, well, there'll always be more money. Don't worry about it. Okay? Not everybody, depending on where your chart sits and everything. But for some, some Scorpios are like, oh, there'll be more. Don't worry. And I think you're going to get away from that thought pattern. Okay? Um, it's it's kind of dragging you down. You know what I mean? And even though there's justice coming, you know, there there's something that's a little hidden yet or a little confusing to you. So maybe you don't have all the, the details worked out, but you're going to be successful with this. Okay, let me show you this reading. Okay, so money, justice, ooh, that's a good one. Ending something with nothing new. So see how this, like, this is your destiny. There's a little bit of juggling going on. How to quit from juggling. See, there is success, and there is a person of power you're dealing with. That could be the government, even. But it's somebody where there's juggling of money with justice. Everything will end up being okay. And as you're figuring this all out. Okay. Okay? So... I have a new deck called uh, Archangel Raphael's Healing Cards. You can find those on my Amazon, okay? Um, stay positive. Stay positive through all this. That's going to be very helpful to see through this, okay? Get a second opinion. Now, remember I told you there was a King of Cups that could be your second opinion who is wise counsel, okay? Remember, wise counsel is a King of Cups. 
And sobriety, you know, staying the course so you can think it through. Sobriety doesn't just mean not drinking. It's staying grounded, staying logical, thinking things through clearly, okay? And hydration. Make sure you drink enough water because I'm going to tell you, it will change your life if you up your water, I'm telling you. All right? And improving your health. See, that's what this is all about. This is all about this month. Not overworking yourself, uh, you know, keeping in balance, you know, how, what can you back off to make yourself healthy and well? Because it's not worth it. The money isn't worth it. Okay. Blessings to you. Make it a great day. And how can you make the planet a better place?